Today, we are going to take popular YouTubers and see what their online persona would look like realistified. Spoiler alert, it's, it's all cursed. All right, so the first YouTuber that I figured we would realistify is none other than our buddy old pal. Dream, of course. So let's see here. Let's just uh, borrow this image here real quick. Just, just gonna borrow it. Just gonna borrow it. Let's just hope that that wasn't an NFT. Now let's just cut Dream out of the image. There we go. Fantastic. So all we got is this little uh, creepy smiling face. I don't know. Maybe, he's, maybe he's not creepy enough. I, th I think we can make him creepier now. Skin. We need we need a creepy skin texture. All right, now now that we got the skin, let's maybe warp it a little bit just so that it looks a little three dimensional. Something like that. There we go. I think. All right. So we. <laughs> why does that just look like a thumb? Oh, it's the thumb boy. All right. So there we go. We got we got all the skinness. We got all the skins on the stuff. Now let's select every crevice, every little dream crep. That was a weird sentence. Let's not let's not say that. Let's say something different. Yeah. Something different. All right. <laughs> Why does that already look so disturbing? Wow. All right, so we're starting to get somewhere, but I definitely think we can up the creepiness. Oh god. Oh, I cannot show those things. Oh, no. oh my god. Yeah, I'm not gonna be using any of those images. All right, so let's uh, let's uh, focus let's focus on the mouth instead. Now, what what type of lips do you think Dream possesses? Call me crazy, but I I don't think any of these belong to Dream. I don't know, maybe these. You know what? I like those. Let's steal those lips. Don't mind if I do. And already, just just if we place those lips right there, that's already looking insanely cursed. But I, I think we can do better. I think we can do a lot better. So let's place those lips on maybe 50% so we can see what we're doing here. And then we can go over to liquefy and uh, go, go to town, I guess. <laughs> Let's place that on full opacity and start smoothing into the body. And it looks disgusting. Is this why Dream hasn't done a face reveal yet? Because this is how he actually looks like? Thank you, Dream. On behalf of all humanity, thank you for not revealing this face. <laughs> So I wasn't really sure about what to do with Dream's eyes. So I decided to make them into these belly button looking things. You know, belly button or other... No, belly button. Yeah, okay. It's a belly button. Guys, it's a belly button. It's not an ass. You're an ass. W would I really would I really put a couple of asses as I... I would think that you guys would think higher of me. Okay, fine. It's a couple of buttholes. But it works! God, what is this? What have I created? <laughs> I, I don't like looking at this. I really don't like looking at this. All right, so, I mean, we are pretty much finished with this monstrosity. Now, I want to place him in something. What? Where, where should we place him? Let's go for a creepy cave. All right, there we go. We, we got a little cave action. All right, so this is already looking quite nasty, but I do think there is one thing missing, and that is a good torso. All right, let's uh, grab this image of this lovely gentleman right here, and then we can start warping it, making it fit. Now, I never thought I would have to add ask myself this question but where where do you think dreams nipples would be like there or like yay there let me know in the comment section and actually don't let me know in the comment section down below let's uh, let's just avert the subject all together let's uh <laughs> let's not talk about dreams nipples all right and finally let's throw a camera raw filter on this <laughs> because why not we might as well try to make it look pretty all right so here we have the finished realistic dream it's an abomination 
and I really never want to see it ever again, but I do have to save it because I have to use it for the thumbnail. All right, so here we have the final cursed realistic dream. Now, if for some reason you would like a copy of this image, the link for it will be in the description down below. Although I have no idea why anybody would want to keep this. All right, so the next YouTuber that I figured we would realistify is an old friend of ours, actually. I am talking about none other than Mr. Corrales. Now, I can't seem to find any HD images of our boy. So I'm gonna do some cheating. I'm gonna go to a website that claims to be able to upscale images using AI. So let's see how that works. I'm, I'm sorry, Corrales, for testing out AI capabilities on your face, but it it has to be done. Doesn't really need to be done, but I, I say it does, so it, it does. There we go, okay, so the website is telling me we can download our image. That's the best it could do. What is going... You know what? We're going to change his eyes anyways. It's fine. Okay, perfect. Great image. All right, so... Corrales' skin, for those who don't know. This is this is Corrales' skin right here. He got the large eyes and the, and the big, big mouth right there. That's the skin. You know what? Let's actually grab the skin so that we can have it as a little reference. All right, so there we go. We got the document ready for Mr. Corrales. Now, this one is a little bit weirder for me to do because I did it. I don't know Dream. I know Corrales. He's, he's my buddy. So this... <laughs> I I do hope he's okay with this. Should have probably checked in first. All right. Well, we're doing it. Let's uh, let's grab some eyes. We need we need a couple of eyeballs. Let's let's see here. Eyeball. All right. This eye right here is perfect. I mean, already. Look at that. We're done. This <laughs> this is all we needed to do. Lovely. Now, in order to get that to fit. I do think we need to liquefy Corrales' face just a little bit. There we go. He didn't look cursed enough already. But <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. There we go. Uh, his, his face now has room for his eyes. Good. Now let's see if we can actually incorporate them into his face. <laughs> Corrales' eyes don't actually seem to have any pupils. Boom! All right, fantastic. So they look even more cursed now. All right, there we there we go. We got the we got the pupils of our boy. Now let's see what we can do about that open mouth of his. All right, so I found this mouth right here that I think we can use. Oh, that's gonna be so, that's gonna be perfect. Yes, I am. I am excited. Now Corrales' skin does not have a nose. It seems like so. Let's just cancel that out by putting the mouth way up there. Now we are going to be smoothing the mouth inwards, but first we need to liquefy him a little bit more just so that the mouth will actually fit. Wonderful, great, fantastic even. All right, uh, <laughs> now let's get that mouth smoothed in. All right, so the mouth is sort of smoothed in. Another thing I want to do is remove his teeth. And I claim that we're friends. Let's see if we can just do this really simply using the healing brush. I don't think we're gonna be able to do if if that works, I swear to God. That worked, and oh no, that looks so nasty! <laughs> oh wow, okay. That is insanely nasty. All right, well, now let's see if we can get rid of his stubble because his Minecraft skin does not have any stubble. If I can remove his beard just like this, then technology has gone too far. Nope, good. Okay, fantastic. So we are not going to be taken over by a cybernetic overlord anytime soon. So I guess we're gonna have to do this the manual way. All right, now for some final shading. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so cursed. Let's uh, fix his ears a little bit. Guys, let me just be very clear on something. <laughs> These things that we are making here today, they're not supposed to be masterpieces. They are supposed to be not that great to look at. Uh, now let's see here. All right, um, hands off the keyboard. I don't want to look at this face. I'm just, Corrales, if you're watching this, I love you, man. You know I love you to pieces, but 
your face. Uh, there's something wrong with it. Mm, don't want to look at it. All right, so let's take a quick little. Oh my god, no, no. None of these are none of these are good to look at. I don't want to look at any of them. All right, well, I, I we got Corrales. Corrales is ready, my dude. You've seen better days, my friend. Now again, if you would like to save this image, the link for it will be in the description. But I am silently judging everybody that saves a copy of these images. W what is wrong with you? W why are you doing that? Alright, so we got time for one more YouTuber. So for the last one, we are going to be making this guy. Uh, this guy. Speed ups. This one is going to be interesting. We got the large eyes, much like the Corrales one. But then we also have that creepy open mouth. Not to mention that. <laughs> That blank stare that stares right into my soul, unveiling all the secrets that I thought I had buried a long time ago. Anyway, let's uh, let's start out with uh, with his face, with his actual face. Oh, this one is perfect when he's like leaning into the camera. <laughs> Once we are finished, that is going to be absolutely perfect. But I do want to up the resolution just a little bit so all right there we go uh, the ai has finished let's take a look at the finished product oh you know what that that was not a bad job at all do you see this tiny little image that we started with right here very small very little pixels and then we just dropped it into some ai and bibbity boobity boom we get a high quality picture of b-dubs beautiful great fantastic all right there we go we got we got mr b-dubs He's gone. Oh, he's back. Okay. Don't don't scare me like that, my love. B-Dubs got the same large eyes as Mr. Corrales does. So my thought was just to select all of the things that has to do with the eyes. And then we can just drop it. That's a weird placement, Dad. <laughs> Looks so strange. Let's just fix that up. There we go. Place them right there where they belong. What a what a handsome little man. Big man. I'm sorry, beatups. You're big man. Now for the mouth, we need a smiling mouth. This smile seems about right. So we got we got our beautiful beautiful smile for beatups. <laughs>
right, there we go. That's, that's lovely. That's beautiful even. All right, so here we have the finished P double O. Now he may be a sleeper, but I for one will never sleep again. So uh, yeah, thank you, P dubs. Now the link for this image will be in the description down below, but I still don't understand why anybody would want that. All right, so I decided to do one more YouTuber before we finish off this video. And that YouTuber is Mumbo Jumbo. Now the reason why I couldn't end the video without doing Mumbo was because of the eyes on his Minecraft skin. They have never made sense to me. They are just a couple of black pixels on his face. And I don't know, I felt like since we gave Dream the treatment, I think Mumbo is in need of a couple of belly buttons. I'm telling you guys, it's belly buttons. <laughs> Realistic Cursed Mumbo Jumbo. Now, like for all previous images, the link for this image will be in the description down below. All right, so here we have all the images that we made today. What is this video, man? Which one was your favorite? Let me know in the comment section down below. Should we do another one of these? Let me know which YouTubers you think should be realistified in a cursed way in the comment section down below. Anyway, guys, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you like this video. And I will see all of you beautiful faces in the next one. Have a good one, guys.